Hi, this is Francisco Bujan from VitalCoaching.com. We are talking about breakups for men and the topic for this video is five breakup attitudes that don't work. When you are in the breakup zone, very often you will naturally tend to take a cer certain attitude that really is going to lead you into some form of emotional dead end. So I want to warn you about these attitudes. Maybe you know them already, but I want to warn you so that you choose for strategies, attitudes, and directions that really work on the long term. So those ones are the ones that really don't work. Okay? So if you are practicing any of those, you have to shift your attitude, shift your strategy, and start going in another direction. Okay? The first strategy that doesn't work is trying to get back together. In 95% of the cases, this is a dead end. So what guys tend to do when they practice this, uh, this attitude, this uh, loser in a way attitude, is to try to force themselves into their ex life. And uh, they will do that and eventually she is going to get so pissed with them, she's going to get so angry, so mad that she's going to totally exclude them uh, out, of, out of her life. So you have to be very careful with that. If you keep on hitting a wall, really heading towards the direction where there is simply no open avenue, no open possibility, eventually you are going to get hurt and you are going to hurt other people. So getting back together, trying to get back together is one of the attitudes that usually doesn't work. Why? Because she went through a cycle, moved on, decided to date somebody else, and right now she's forgetting about you. Okay? That's the first attitude that doesn't work. Second attitude that doesn't, doesn't work is self-pity. When you put yourself within the self-pity position, you know, you take this, uh, this uh, posture, uh, it's again, it's uh, thinking that you are the victim of some form of uh, negative conspiracy that goes against you. This is not the case at all. Your life is full of potential. All you have to do is start embracing it. These kind of things happen. They happen to anybody. And uh, yes, sometimes it's, it's tough. It's really a big challenge. But the key is to realize that, hey, when there is a storm, you don't complain about the fact that there is a storm. You complain. You don't complain. You simply go through it, try to find attitudes, uh, strategies to win this challenge, and make sure that you go through it as a winner. Okay? So self-pity is another one of those attitudes that is going to create an emotional dead end for you. The third attitude is being self-destructive. You know, going to drugs, alcohol, or doing anything else stupid, losing your job, these kind of things. These are self-destructive loops which are going also to, uh, to create lots of trouble for you in your life. So you don't want to take that attitude either. Another uh, key attitude which uh, is very challenging as well to take is uh, going straight away into a rebound relationship, right? Maybe you think that uh, the only way for you to be stable and, and happy and healthy is to jump into a committed relationship with somebody else straight away, even though you know that this person is not free on the long term. That would be another big mistake because in this transition zone, in this breakup zone where you are, um, very often it's important to find answers, it's important to find out why the breakup happened, what were the key challenges that you face in your relationship and how to overcome them in the future. Okay? So if you jump into a new relationship straight away, most of the times you miss this uh, kind of soul searching moment where uh, you can uh, reset some, some key attitudes or behaviors in your life. And it's important to learn the lessons of a past relationship so that you can jump into a new relationship later with uh, you know, new tools and new skills. So jumping into a rebound relationship straight away, I think that's one of the key um, you know, attitudes that, uh, that are maybe a mistake you know, to, to go into straight away. Um, another attitude, the fifth attitude, which is uh, really, um, really taking this kind of loser position, uh, is uh, playing the broken record, right? You go, every time you are with friends, you keep on talking about her on and on and on again. And when you do that, again, you are reinforcing this victim role, this victim position, and eventually your friends, everybody runs away from you. They think that you are hopeless because there, there doesn't seem any change. So taking this kind of broken record attitude is, uh, is again uh, one of the, the strategies that don't work. So to know the strategies that work, go back to my program, of course, check the other videos. But for now, I just wanted to give you a quick look on uh, these strategies that don't work. I will summarize them for, for you again. It's um, trying to get back together, uh, taking the self-pity uh, attitude, being self-destructive, jumping into a rebound relationship, and uh, playing the broken record. Okay, that's it for now. Take care and bye-bye.